Hey friends, welcome to my life. My name is Ellen, entrepreneur, podcast host, and founder of Cubicle to CEO. Follow my journey to seven figures as I work in the trenches to build my business empire and help you build yours. Okay, so one of the biggest questions I always get is how do I beat the Instagram algorithm? You're probably like wringing your hands, trying to keep up with the ups and downs, the changes left and right coming at you from Instagram. And it can be so frustrating when you feel like you're putting in all this work and your content is not being seen by the by anyone, or maybe it's not being seen by the right people. And trust me, I totally feel your frustrations. So one of the key strategies that I've been focusing on in 2019 for both myself and my clients, as well as what I teach my, uh, what I teach my members inside of cubicle to CEO is that Instagram right now has a golden era for direct messages in Instagram. Why? Because they are the only part of Instagram that are not directly impacted by the algorithm in the sense that your direct messages still show up in chronological order when people send and receive messages. And that's where conversation and connection really happens. And so you may notice, you know, on your feed, your posts are not in chronological order on your stories. Um, the people whose stories you watch most often are the ones that show up at the front of your feed on your home page. But direct messages is still this like untouched gold mine for Instagram. And while that is still the case, I would highly encourage you to dive deeper into direct messages and to really focus your time there. One of the best ways to do this is to watch other people's stories and reply to them. This is a twofold reason. One, because when you respond to someone's Instagram story, you are making them feel seen and heard first. Instead of just sliding into someone's DMs as a cold outreach, which can feel really icky and slimy, you're actually starting a conversation with them about something they're already interested in and talking about. So watch people's stories, engage with them, ask them questions, try to actually get to know the person behind the screen. And this gives you a warm introduction into their direct message inbox. And the second part of this strategy is when you do this, try to have a live video or stories active on your profile too, because someone who receives a direct message from a stranger that responded to their story is most likely going to head over to your profile and watch your story too. And when this happens, if they choose to follow you, the next time you post your story, your story will show up at the front of the feed on their homepage, which is amazing. This gives you prime placement on their Instagram feed, and this is not the same way that it works with normal feed posts. So now you are not only being seen more often because you're showing up first in their stories feed, but you also got a warm introduction into their inbox for you to continue the conversation further. And if you really focus in on the strategy and try to connect with one, five, 10, 20 people every single day, you will be so surprised how much growth and momentum your business can have. And so I hope this tip really helps you guys out. If you want to know more key strategies on how to grow on Instagram, and use social media marketing to explode your business. Let's talk inside my membership, Cubicle to CEO. I would love to see you in there. For more information about that, check out the link below. And if you found this video helpful, please go ahead and hit the thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe so you never miss out on another video. Talk soon.